Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's 16 box St. Patrick's Day basketball mixer. Actually, lucky you guys, the picture has 17 boxes. And guess what? This 2016-17 Prism Blaster box, this green one, is the 17th box on the 17th. It's your lucky day. St. Patrick's Day. It is your lucky day, ladies and gentlemen. So you thought, you bought into this thinking, what a deal for 16 boxes and the chance to win those green, that green Luca and the green Zion, right? Now it's even better. Even better. There it is. Not even on the list, but in the picture, 17th box for the 17th. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into the action. These are all the people who bought their spots straight up. Fred, last spot, Mojo, star next to his name. And the rest of you won those spots in Cello Pack Break 22, Cello Pack Break 23, and Cello Pack Break 24. I appreciate everybody buying into those packs, and congrats again to the winners. All 30 basketball teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Uh, nine times, six and a three. Your name's first. Two... Three. And ninth and final time. After nine times, we've got John down to Derek. Six and a three, nine times for the teams. Good luck. And ninth and final time. After nine times, we got the Sacramento Kings all the way down to the Cavs. So after I go through all these teams and tell you what you got, I'm going to pause the video and set up all these boxes on my table here during the trade window. All right, John with the Kings, Nicholas with the Grizz, William with the Celtics, Derek with the Blazers, Rob with the Warriors, Eastwood with the uh, Spurs, Fred with the Thunder, Kevin with the Clip. Cody with the Raps. Do they kind of call them the Raps? Derek with the Bucks. Rob with the Nets. Jonathan L with the Mavs. Derek with the Timberwolves. Cody with the Nuggets. Fred, last spot mojo, Chicago Bulls. Greg with the Magic. Bill with the Sixers. Evan with the Pelicans. Michael with the Hawks. Sean Corbett, Hornets. We've got uh, the Knicks for James O. Daniel with the Wizards. SKS with the Lakers, my Lakers. Scott with the Pacers, David with the Rockets, AJ with the Heat, Evan with the Jazz, Josh with the Suns, Lewis with the Pistons, and Derek with the Cavs. Let's alphabetize this by team. Now remember, trades are allowed, but remember to trade at your own risk. And remember just to keep in mind the different draft classes that are available and all this stuff. All right, so when we come back, We'll have all, I'll have all the boxes set up. We're going to see if there's any trades. So stick around. We'll be right back. All right. Welcome back, everybody. There was a flurry of, uh, of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done. Also, at the end of the break, uh, for St. Patrick's Day, we're giving away some green here, boys and girls. So at the end of the break, we're going to re-randomize all of your names. And I think the first name, yeah, name on top, will get the Luca. The second name will get this Zion right here, these very ones. And then the third name will get any, if there's any points, that'll be in that third slot right over there. So we'll set the, where, where should I put these so I don't forget? I'll put this right next to my microphone here so we'll know. All right, let's go. I'm not going to go in any particular order. I'm going to, well, I'm kind of in an order. I'm going to do this first just to get this bulky box out of the way. Then we'll probably do the cello packs next, then Donruss basketball, then we'll kind of work our way into the rest of the stuff, especially the sort of higher end hit heavy stuff. This is just to get this box out of the way. So remember, instead of 16 boxes, 17 boxes total in here, you got a bonus box. Ooh. This versus book will be a randomizer at the end. We got OKC, OKC versus Spurs, Spurs. So it'll be a randomizer. That's going to be also a randomizer at the end. We'll set that way over there. Uh, 
All right. Our first guy here is Cassie Russell. Five out of ten die cut. Old Laker. And that'll be oh, that'll be for oh, come on, printer. The printer's doing the thing where it says I have no toner, but I clearly have toner. But it thinks I have zero percent. So then it stops my printer from operating until I open up the thing and close it again. This is a this is a toner scam, ladies and gentlemen. This is a big toner trying to get into our pockets. I mean, it's a little light, but uh, pl plenty more pages to go. Plenty more pages to go. This is a big toner just trying to bring us down. There's the official uh, printout right there, ladies and gentlemen. Next one is another die cut autograph. That's uh, Jack Sigma. 8 out of 49 die cut auto. That'll be for that'll go to OKC. Fred Williams with a Thunder. And we've got Charlie Scott Sons. 52 out of 99. Phoenix. By the time I get to Phoenix. Josh Pruce. You'll be rising. Alright. I gotta stretch my hands out for these cello packs. So this is Contenders. Wait. Not, these aren't cello packs. Where, what's the Contenders here? I guess these, is this how they come? In these ones? Oh, I guess it's, how many, how many are in each of these? Contender cell packs for a little different. Do they have packs inside? I hope no. Oh, okay, that's not bad. No packs inside. I think it's Donner's Optic. It has packs inside. And Prism that has packs inside packs. Why can't they just make them like these? All right, so this is 2019-2020. So people with like the Pelicans and the Grizzlies pay attention to at least this box right here. go what, what's any chip what are we looking for here look for retail exclusive green shimmer on card autographs is what we're looking for correct veteran commons will not ship in this
But inserts, of course, will ship like that Jackson Hayes insert. I guess he's a rookie too, so. Really, we're just looking for inserts and autos, right? We got the feud on, of course, now that all that free agent frenzy news on NFL Network is over. Now, how many points did the first person get? 70. That's not good. I say under 200 on this guy, this team right here. Not this guy in particular, but just it's hard to make up. He did pretty good. Steve Harvey, did you see he got Steve Harvey? What's a sport you can't play on grass? And he says ice hockey, and then that got Steve Harvey. He usually doesn't get got. A whole box of these packs and no auto. I thought I was going to see at least one, even if it was just some rando, but there's Zion right here. That Zion will go to Evan, though. Yeah, well, I mean, except for the inserts, yeah, but pretty much a lot of those are just veteran commons. All right, now we got Donner's Optic, also from 1920, this current year, cello packs. Wow, they got it, 234. Second guy crushed it, they got 20 grand, fast, fast money. I was going under 200 on that one. But they they, they they were pretty, pretty good. Is Family Feud taped? Last time I asked this question, I feel like people said LA, but he said they're in Atlanta right now. Maybe they they, tra they must travel, right? They this must be a show that goes around the country. Love Steve Harvey. Doesn't 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 matter. Well, old old lady, old women. <laughs> I love Steve Harvey. This lady right here, Diane. She's Diane Jorgensen. All about this. She's all the words. Cut to cut to her. Cut to Diane. 
There she is, right there at the very end. Man. Cell packs. I know. Fun. Fun stuff. Oh, we're going to get into more fun stuff, too. Actually, we'll go through some Donner's, ba uh, Donner's baseball, Donner's basketball after this. Then we'll start working through, I don't know, maybe that Donner's optic hobby box back there. We do have Panini, some old Panini basketball hiding over there in the bag. That's kind of card heavy. But once we get through that, then we'll start flying through some of the fun stuff. Rex is asking, you haven't watched the video? You should watch the video. But what was my, rea my, my reaction was, son of a gun. Golly gee willikers, you know? I may have even cursed and said, damn. Which I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. Cursing. What if I did uh what if I did reaction vids to my reactions? Was that a thing yet? Reaction to my reactions. Hey, what's going on? It's a reaction vid for uh <laughs> wanna watch uh, Joe Jaspi react to these cards? I'm Joe, reacting to the reaction. And then you guys can you guys can do your own fan videos, reacting to my reactions, reacting. People love reaction videos, right? be like make sure you subscribe and hit the bell to be notified every time I have a new reaction to my reactions <laughs> we laugh Rex says lol you laugh now Rex but that might be a bigger that might end up being a bigger channel than this channel right here where we actually do work like real work the reaction channel Rea my reaction to my reactions of me unboxing cards could end up being bigger than this channel here. All right. What do we got in here? I'm looking to see these ones aren't numbered, but they will ship these purple. I think they're considered purple. But we are looking for the big rookie names, especially if they are refractors, if they're hollows. That's what we want to see. LeBron James is too. And we got an autograph here. We got D'Anthony Melton Signature Series. That's for the Grizz. That's going to be for Nicholas L. and Memphis. Leaf has a retweet, and they wrote unbelievable. That's pretty good. <laughs> I like that. Sean, you're going to make a game for, for me, your reactions game, where you have to match your reaction to the eventual card that was pulled. Now, how does that work? Like, just, are you, like, are you going to have a clip of, of my reactions? 
and then attach them to different cards, like a remix video? Is that what you're saying? Michael Bridges, pink, to 25. PJ Washington Hollow. Oh, video plays. This is a video of me watching a video of myself, and it stops before before the card's revealed, and I have to guess what it's going to be. Oh no, that's terrible, Sean Corbett. I would that would never work. I barely remember what I pulled in the last break. I don't even know what the last break I did was. What was the last break before my dinner break? What did I eat? This is, I just, this, this, this is just a blur. Every day is just a blur to me. <laughs> I, just, I hope I put on a good show yesterday. And people were, seem, seem like people were entertained. All right. These will all ship, obviously, because they'll be considered inserts. They're these blue velocity the velocity pattern in the background. And remember, not numbered, but they they will all ship. You know, do we have like a Zion or a Zion or John Morant in here somewhere? That'd be nice. No, but some nice stuff in there nonetheless. All right. Uh, let's get into some Donruss basketball. That could be a good game, though, Sean, if, uh, if other people can remember. I don't think I could do it. I would lose that game every time. It's like, uh, was that a Zion? You'd be like, nope. That was a, a one of one printing play. And I was like, oh. <laughs> I do kind of like like the idea of yeah, like a mystery theater two thousand where I'm re like reacting to my own. Would that be too meta? Where I'll be like reacting to my own reactions, reacting. Oh, Brian! There you go, Brian. Brian's got some feud info for me. Family feud info. First season was in twenty ten. Taped in Orlando. Then Steve Harvey wanted to go to his home turf in Atlanta and tape there, which they did until 2017 before moving out to L.A. All right. All right, all right. So they're in L.A. now. How do you get on the feud? I know... The only show I ever auditioned for was uh, was Jeopardy, and I don't think I got past like the phone test. <laughs> One of my buddies got past the phone test and actually got to go to like this big like conference hall or whatever, banquet hall or whatever, where they, were, they had like a written test or something like that. I think he got that far. Computer test or something? Did they set up computers or they? I think it was a written test or something like that. I think he got that far, but then he didn't get a call back. But how does... Like, do they vet your family? Like, to make sure you're actually a family? Do you have to be a family? Seems like you do. Yeah, that I do. I feel like that's common with a lot of game shows, right? Yeah, like Family Feud, they'll 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 tape like 
right, almost the entire year, or as much as they can. But they'll do multiple shows a day. Like I think, like, um, like Wheel of Fortune, they'll knock out like a dozen episodes or day or something crazy like that. I thought that was John Morant, not Jay Crowder. You have to have five family members, Brian, saying related by blood or legal adoption. Got it. All right. I like that. It's Kayvon Looney to 99 for the Warriors. That'll be for Rob. There's a Hachimura for Daniel. AJ, your parents were on prices, right? That's pretty cool. They, they went on down and all that. One of my buddies of mine works as, I think one of the, he's like one of the main sound engineers uh, on, on the Price is Right. Like that's like his day job. Um, there's Romeo Langford for William and the Celtics. And they're like, yeah, pretty much you need, you need like a crew there. It's good to have a bunch of your friends or family there making a bunch of noise and just be as obnoxious as possible and your chances are pretty good that you'll get on the show. But yeah, that, I think that's on, is that on CBS? On the CBS studios on Fairfax, I think, in Los Angeles. Not too far from Fairfax High School, ladies and gentlemen, where uh, the Red Hot Chili Peppers were born. Or at least most of them, I think, went to Fairfax High. 20 out of 25, Admiral Schofield, and your dad oh, lost. Uh, Schofield, we'll put over on that side over there. D. Leo, say they interview you and your company before the show. Got it. There's Coos to ninety nine. Uh, oh, I like all this information, this feud information you're bringing me, Brian A.U. We got April and May. They have open audition for families and multiple locations that vary. They have contestant hotline called a book, play a mock version of the game, take a family photo. The whole thing takes about 20 minutes. Wow. Yeah, right. They just make sure that you're, that you're at least somewhat camera friendly. John Morant for the Grizz. That goes to Nicholas L., no, I like all this feud information. It's always interesting to see how you've been on this. What's the so what's the what what about Wheel of Fortune, which seems like a which seems like a kind of an easy show, right? I'm sh do you like? I wonder what the I don't know. We'll figure that out. Zion Williamson. That is for Evan Levine, who got randomized the Pels. In the 17 box St. Patrick's Day basketball mixer. We're only a couple or a few boxes in, ladies and gentlemen, so we still have a little ways. There's Jersey Series, Kevin Love. That'll be for Derek and the Cavs. And just in the interest of time, we'll have all these top loaded, uh, top loaded later as our team sorting these out. Stop. That Zion is 100 bucks. Like raw, not graded. There's Serge Ibaka to 99. Wow, that's what Dar that's what Leo D Leo is saying. That Zion, hundred bucks raw. Crazy, crazy talk. Let's move. Uh, actually, let's let's save that. Let's slide these little guys over here. Let's get this guy out of the way. This old 2013-14. Basketball, Missy Kobe. Is this Zion or uh, Zion? Is this Giannis here, or is it fourteen fifteen? No, thirteen fourteen's Giannis here, right? Uh, 
Oh, hi, Nick. 1314 is Giannis. Okay. Cool. Nice. So. So, Bucks, Derek, Leo, D. Leo. This is, this is time for you to kind of pay attention here. Yes, this is... Oh, sorry. This is... Yeah, this is... Uh, Donner's bas that was Donner's basketball, regular Donner's basketball. Donner's optic. All right, Philip saying, yeah, that that's Donner's optic is when you kind of get to that 60 60 ish, maybe more range. But yeah, this was just regular old Donner's basketball. The design's kind of similar, so yeah, if you're kind of just half watching, then it's just like, oh. All right, yeah, D. Leo. I think this is the only, aside from Preferred, which we already did, this is the only, no, we actually have Timeless Treasures. That's also Giannis, obviously. So you got two more Giannis rookie opportunities. Autograph? I mean, that would be, let's not, let's not dream that big yet. <laughs> Let's just start with a with the rookie card first. Did we hit a rookie yesterday, Philip? Giannis rookie? That's not bad. I know we did a bat. I know Jason did a basketball mixer last night. By the way, Brian AU was giving us some Family Feud information. Was also saying that uh, they don't pay for any of the the flight and lodging and everything. That's all. That's all on your dime as a family. So that's kind of cool because now you're like extra motivated. It's like if we're gonna get move, take this entire family all the way out there. You know, like we better win that. We better win that fast money. Giannis Antetokounmpo, rookie card. Hopefully there could be like a couple of these and then maybe one of them, one of them gradable and then one of them turns out to be a million dollars. There you go, good start. You know the Lakers are still paying Luel Deng. I think they've got one, one or two more seasons of paying him like a couple of million dollars after he got his contract was stretched and then he was stretched and then released. And we've got Kenyon Martin. Remember Kenyon Martin? Cool stuff. Kenyon Martin. Yeah, he went. He was like pretty decent. Was he always Knicks? No, he played with Denver. I was gonna say I remember Denver, Denver Kenyon Martin. Yeah. I didn't. Re I don't remember Knicks Kenyon like, Martin. Yeah, I was there. And Carmelo and all that. Right, right. That that era of the Denver Nuggets. That that's Knicks edition. That'll go to James O. Here's Oladipo. There's another sneaky rookie in this thirteen fourteen stuff. Oladipo, I think, is is the is the uh, big reason why um, <laughs> why you like you can't ignore like the the rookies that kind of not do well. You know what I mean? In their first couple years, it's open, Nick. Thank you. Um, that don't do well their first couple years because there's that Oladipo story that always makes you think. But I think Oladipo, that's Brandon Knight, Oladipo must have been at the like the very tail end of how long I would even keep a player before. 
But you never know, especially in basketball. And especially since so many rookies are so young nowadays. You know, it's good to like keep some of these guys for at least three or four seasons. There's Jeff Withy. Because you never know. That's Pelicans. That'll go to Evan. Pretty sure this guy you can probably... Don't really need. Another Giannis. One of these has to grade out decently. You know, I know they've been rattling around in these old packs for some years. You know, that corner's not perfect, but... I don't know. One of those. Who knows? It's another uh, Milwaukee Buck, by the way, for D. Leo in the chat. Derek. All right, there you go. Yeah, two in one box. Not too shabby, D. Leo. Not too shabby at all. And Oladipo in the mix there, too, for Gregory and the uh, Orlando Magic. All right, what should we think? All of the bulky stuff we got kind of out of the way. We're gonna we'll do that optic, and then we'll we'll rock some retail. Actually, let's do seven. Let's do the slightly older one first. 1718 Prison Basketball Retail. Then we'll work our way back to 2019 Donruss Optic Basketball. And maybe curl back around to some status. Uh, we'll kind of bounce around a little bit. So this... This is 1718 edition, so... Um, William Celtics, Jason Tatum here. So William Punt ears should perk up a little bit. I think is this our only? These two boxes are only two seventeen eighteen. Oh, status is back there. That's seventeen eighteen as well. Um, on the Optic 8 Team Random Kevin, how did we F that up? Well, who got the extra spot then? Someone got an extra spot. Was it that guy? No. That person? No. That person? No. That person? No. No. That person? No.
All right. Sorry, Kevin. Um, We're going to have to refund you for that. I apologize about that, man. That was my bad. Yeah, well, I, to I totally missed that one. I apologize. I got your order printed out. I'll make sure you get refunded. I would have been able to if... I would have been able to try to figure out what team were you supposed to have, but the, I added the person that got the extra spot got two names, so I don't know which one yours your team would have been. If it was a unique person, I would be able to say, well, you were supposed to be in that person's slot. Let's give it to you, but unfortunately not. Sorry about that. We'll take care of that. All right. Um, can someone confirm what Sean is saying? Sean is a, a Raider hater, so I can't really, I can't really, uh, believe what he says on that. No, they're going to get it. They got the 20,000, I think. There's Chinano Unaku, Onuaku, that is. No, they got it. They got one question left. Unless he gets his goose egg on this one. August. You got to get at least one point there. 43. That's the second best answer. Boom. Rockets, that goes to David Sitko in Houston. Nick Millen, pink pulsar to 42. That's second year Ben Simmons. Save one of these two. I don't know. He's probably trolling Theo, so I'm not going to waste my time looking it up. But I mean, you kind of assume that it's going to. There's going to be players who are going to who are going to get it. A lot of players. Got a little train whistle going there. Nice one, Edmund.
Oh, it's now now it's the entire team, says Rex. Next one, Serge Ibaka to 199, Toronto. Oh, I had one more of those, forgot about that. Hachimura, Nasir Little Hollow. I was so eager to get to this one. Damari Carroll, Lime Green to 149. All right, and Isaiah Roby, rated rookie autograph. Uh, Dallas. Jonathan L. with that one. Cam Reddish Hollow, nice. Mike Lyons with that one, Michael Lyons. And then there's Nicola Melli to 99. No, now Re Rex News. Not exactly the most trustworthy source, but the Rex News saying the NFL has been canceled and Tom Brady's just going to win uh, the Super Bowl for the Bucks just default. There's NFL's just going to give it to him. All clear for takeoff, Zion. Roger, Roger Goodell is just like, eh. All right, thank you, Sam. Sam, I can trust. All right, Jabari Parker to 149. <laughs> Good answer, good answer. Let's go back to this really quick. All right, so we're back to 1718. Sorry, William. William Punt has the Celtics in this one. No, it's not the truth I can't handle, Sean. It's just like you have you have branded yourself at Jaspies as a notorious uh, notorious troll, the, the deliverer of false information, especially when it pertains to teams you dislike. So, no, but Sam Strayer saying uh, Quinn Pauling and his wife and his apparently two-year-old daughter, they've self-tested and. They've got it. Yeah, it's on his Twitter, according to Sam. Well, thankfully, it seems as if, unless there's pre-existing conditions, it seems as if, like, it's, it's, it's something that afflicts the elderly far less than it afflicts the, uh, the, the very young. So, I mean, the two-year-old should be okay. Where were, oh, they got it, oh, they were in Spain. I'll do it. Sean saying his wife could technically be super old and at risk and, and just had a two-year-old. All right, I mean, it's possible, but not probable.
All right. Terrence Ferguson, rookie silver. And there's Derek White. Rookie auto for the Spurs. All right, Sean. All right, you're right. You're right. Let's move on. And Darius Thornwell. These greens aren't numbered, by the way. Other sets, they're out of five. Uh, 7 out of 42, Alan Crabb. Wait, like rookie, rookie, or was it an insert? I think I accidentally passed the insert. That'll ship. I was really looking for the silver rookies. And if it was an insert, we'll dig that out. We'll find it. Oh, I got it right here. I got it right here. No, no, no. It's worth it, AJ Anderson. That's for you, man. I'd rather pull you like a silver one right there. That's what I was. That's really was just, just kind of focus on that. Or the Jason Tatum for the Celtics, and it's not gonna be anyone's. All right, all right. We're all we're getting there, folks. We're getting there. I think I think Break King Basketball had sold out, so I have got that open. Anything else on them? Now we are kind of out of time. By the time I finish with this, but it looks like we can do well. Break King, we're gonna do for sure. I don't think anything else is really close. What what are people buying then? I don't know. I guess I'll find out. I see, I see like 20 orders here. All right. Well, thanks, everybody. Let's we'll, we'll discover what, what we got into after this break, which is almost done. I think this, is, this stack is about five minutes right there, 10, 20. This, that guy is 30, 30, 20, 20 minutes, 30 minutes right there, and then another 30... Got about another half an hour to go. 20, 30 minutes, 20, 35 minutes. All right, so this is uh, 17, 18 status. So we're, we're, we're still in, uh, we're still in that Jason Tatum Bam out of bio frame of mind, so on, etc. Et among others, among others, Kobe to two ninety nine. I thought it was, I thought it was gonna be an autograph for a second. That'll go to the Lakers. SKS. R I P. Kobe. Miss that guy. And we got a new breed autograph for the Knicks, Frank Tilakina.
There you go. New York Knicks, James O. Dan Smith Jr. Turn around there out of 149. Dallas Mavericks, future teammate. Frank Tilakina. That's Hassan Whiteside. That's Yabuselli to 70 for the Bucks, or for the Celtics, that is. No, no Tatum's there. Sorry. We'll get him next time. We'll find him next time. Uh, that's tonight. That's yeah. There's still there's still a ways, but that's definitely tonight. That's a short break, a very short break. Even if we were, even if we went late, I do that one. There's not much in there. You know what is it? Three boxes, three cards per box. So that's de that's definitely happening. But, yeah, but we still have, let's do the older one first, but we still have a few boxes left, so we'll see if we have time for anything else after that. And don't forget, folks, if you're, uh, if you're feeling like, oh man, Joe, I'm not doing very well this break, don't worry, remember. At the end of the break, we're giving these two cards away. So I'm going to re-randomize everybody's names. Name on top. First name gets the PSA 10 Doncic. Second name will get the Zion. All right, already graded for you. This is 16-17. Uh, that would be... W w Wiggins here? D'Angelo Russell here? <laughs> we'll find out in a second. This was your bonus box too. Remember, it was not on the list, but it's in the picture. So I included it. 17th box now. Oh, it's the Jake Lehman rookie year. Duh. Oh, this is the Simmons year, right? That's definitely a duh. <laughs> That's a Jake. It's the Bryce Johnson years, you guys, obviously. Oh, there's Buddy Heald. No, right. This is the Simmons year. And one, there's Juan Hernan Gomez, rookie relic for the Denver Nuggets. Cody. All right, all right. All right. Uh, let's stay. Let's stay in that sixteen seventeen mindset. Let's stay in that mindset. All right, we're bouncing around the years a little bit. We're traveling forward and backward in time. Enos Cantor, Evan Fournier, and Tony Parker, Giannis Antetokounmpo, Blake Griffin to 99, Jalen Brown for the Celtics, limited rookie. Tristan Thompson, jersey and autograph, 40 out of 99. For the Cavs, Derek Melanson. All right, and we got Giorgio's Papagianis. 96 out of 99. That'll be for the Kings. That's going to be for John. John D. All right. What else? We got that. We got that. Let, let's go back in time again. Let's 
go back in time to 2013-14 Timeless Treasures. Giannis's rookie year. LeBron James, Heat. And behind KG is Bradley Beal, Promising Pros, Relic for Daniel and the Wizards. Andre Roberson, rookie jersey and autograph. Kind of see his auto right there through the clear window. That looks like that's a cool one. Fred Williams, OKC. And there's Corey Brewer, validating marks. T-Wolves. Yeah, sure. I think it's an inter. I think it would have shipped anyway, Timeless Teams. All right. Uh, how about 17-18? Prism Mosaic Basketball. Stephen Punk says, hey, Joe, I think the Bears, Chicago Bears, could have a better record than Tampa Bay. What do you think? You must have, must have missed the news today, Stephen Punk. Must have missed the news today. So these aren't numbered. They will all ship, though. So you can consider them, I guess, parallel. There's, this will definitely ship because that's numbered. Out of 99, Kevin Durant. Draymond Green. Different parallel, not numbered, the blue ones. Josh Hart, rookie. Jonathan Isaac to 99. Paul George, Dirk Nowitzki. Josh Jackson. Nice Jade. There's the Jason Tatum. I like that John Collins, too. Dragic, Kevin Love, Alfred Payton. But there's that Jason Tatum, William Punt. That's what we were looking for. And all these 17, 18 ones. There you go. And what a, ooh, we're, we're pretty close to the end here. This is all, well, let's go the older one first. Then we'll do 19, we'll do 19, 20, 19, 20, 19, 20, 20, 19, 20, 19, 20, 19, 20, 20, 20, 20. Basketball, and then we're done. We'll give away some stuff. We'll do the, uh, the randomizer between those four players over there in that corner. Give away the graded cards, see what happens. Good luck. This is, uh, this should be, this is Choice, by the way. 2018-2019 Panini Prison Basketball Choice Edition. And we got Anthony Simon, Sensational Signatures Autograph. Portland Trailblazers, D. Leo. Spencer Dinwiddie to 88. Brooklyn Nets, Rob, James Harden. 
I guess that will try color, I guess we'll call it. Red, yellow, green. Uh, for David Sitko, SGA. His stuff has been doing pretty well in the secondary market, too. Kevin Bales and the Clip Show. And Luka Doncic. Look at that. Dallas Mavericks, Jonathan L. There you go. Rookie Luka. This will do well in the secondary market. Nice scope pattern in the background there, too. RC right up there. Very nice. All right, let's get into some crown. All right, now we're into the current season right there, 1920. Good luck. Wow, Jason's saying that's 1K raw? Chad's asking, Prism and Optic so hot this year, will baseball products ever reach that level? Mm. It depends, I think. I think that's a, that's a tough question. I think there's two very different sort of markets, right? There's Matisse Teibel. There's just fewer players in basketball. There's, what, 15 men on a roster? You know, no minor league system or anything like that. No prospects. and So just due to supply and demand, a lot of these cards just go so well on a secondary market. Here's Quindary Weatherspoon. So that's what kind of boosts the value on this just overall in general. And then when you add, you know, guys like Luka Doncic and Zion Williamson and stuff like that, then the prices start to go pretty crazy. We got close with um, with Shohei Otani, Aaron Judge, Chris Bryant. That chase was pretty big that year, but nothing as eye watering as with eye watering prices like Zion, Cam Reddish, rookie silhouettes, nice. Uh, Michael Lyons with the, the Atlanta Hawks. And you have to wait a lot for baseball too. Right, so the the real money for baseball, in my opinion, is Bowman draft, right, and 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 regular Bowman baseball. But then you gotta wait. I mean, Cam Reddish is already playing, you know, but you gotta wait for that hot prospect, Joey Bard or Adley Rushman or Bobby Witt Jr. guys like that. Like you get hyped about him after the draft, and then you're like, oh well, I gotta wait for a few years, you know. They, you know, God forbid if they get injured, you know, baseball teams are more, more prone to shut them down really quickly. Say, you're done for the season. We'll see you next year, you know. So you got to have a lot of patience with that before you can start getting those big prices. But we are, we're also in a very unique Zion, like unique year for basketball, especially with Zion, you know, it's very unique. Where this guy, this guy, that guy right there, there he is, that guy combines performance and this sort of extra level, layer of charisma that we have not seen in a long time. There's Lucas Simonich. And that also adds to the value that's for the Spurs and the hype and the prices increasing. Eastwood with that one. But, I mean, you can never, I mean, never say never though, right? If, if there's the right circumstances that click into place. Nikhil Alexander-Walker, you know, and they're, they're, there could be a player that just captures everyone's imagination. Just goes, stuff goes crazy. There's a Tyler Hero for AJ as well. Not a silver, but... 
But supply and demand, there's what, 15 men on a basketball roster, maybe seven or eight regular rotation. So you tend to see these young rookies straight out of college or in high school now in a couple of years, straight out of high school or college go directly onto, onto their teams and contribute some minutes, if not, you know, significant minutes like this guy. Baseball also has a deep minor league system and and uh, twenty man rosters and bullpen guys and so all sorts of stuff. Football, I mean, all there's almost even more, right? Fifty three, fifty two, fifty three men on a roster. A lot of second string defensive backs that end up in like contenders football. You have to sift through all of those before you get like the big quarterback or running back that everyone's facing. Basketball is unique in that sense. Sorry, throw, throwing this pack around. Watch, that has a design on <laughs> The one I dropped. Thankfully, we have these little rubber mats right here to protect everything. All right, we're at the very end. Finally, ladies and gentlemen, we're at the uh, Prison Basketball Hobby Edition. How much does one of these boxes cost nowadays just by itself? Six, seven hundred bucks? It's a lot. Jared Culver, Carson Edwards, Mitchell Robinson to 149, Thomas Bryant, and Shaquille O'Neal Hyper. Kobe White, Lonzo Ball Red, to 299 for the Pels, Damari Carroll, and a Zion, a far out Zion. Let's go, Steve Harvey. Kobe White will go to the Bulls. Fred Williams, last spot mojo. John Morant, Oladipo, Admiral Schofield, the Admiral, is your autograph for Daniel and the Wizards. And John Morant, Nicholas L. with the Grizz, with the spot that he won in... One of those cello pack breaks. It's Kyle Anderson. Mr. Anderson. That's a Jeep Compass. They, Jeep did not pay out for that sponsorship. There's Bowl Bowl, Red Wave. There you go, Zion. Evan with the Pelicans. To Westbrook. And we got Eric Pascal. Dwayne Bacon to 299 for Charlotte. That'll be for Sean. I want like a silver Zion to close things out. We've had a pretty decent break, but pretty nice. I want to close out 
The jaw dropper. You think we'll see one? Still got a little left. Montrez Harrell to 75. Grant Williams. Oh, I saw that. Saw Kenrick Williams. I mean, no offense to Kenrick Williams. <laughs> no offense to Kenrick Williams, but we were looking for your teammate, buddy. This goes to Evan Levine. I saw that. I was sliding the card aside, and no. Grant Williams, rookie silver for William Punt and the Celtics. The Montrez will go to Kevin Bales in the clip show. I mean, LeBron James, not too bad. SKS. JaVel McGee, Jimmy Butler, Clyde, Justin, Dwayne, and Langston at the very end. There you have it, boys and girls. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for breaking with us. Let's, uh... Got a couple of things to do. Now, if you're like, hey, I, Joe, I didn't get a hit in this break, which is very possible. You still have a chance at these guys. We're going to randomize this guy here, too. Two OKCs and two SASs. Let's go back to random.org. Let's go get some fresh dice. Kevin Durant, Serge Ibaka, Tony Parker, Tim Duncan. And everyone's got a shot. And there are no there are no points in here as well. Michael Lyons, down to Daniel. Michael L, down to Daniel L. Everyone has a shot. Name on top, as it says in the item description. Now let's flip back here for a second. Name on top will get the Luka. The second name will get the Zion. All right, so for both randomizers, let's randomize it three and a two. Five times for each list. This one first. One. Two, three, four, and fifth and final time. After five times, San Antonio on top. And that will be for Eastwood with a little consolation at the end. You get this uh, quad relic here. 148 out of 199. All right. Name on top, second name. Just like that, in that order. Good luck. Three and a two, five times. Top two. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. After five times, congrats to five, four, three. Ooh, someone who won a cello pack spot. Cody Passmore with the Zion. Daniel. With the Luca, nice. Congrats to both of you. There you go, Daniel. Luka Doncic, PSA 10, Gem Mint 10. Already graded for you. Already taken care of for you. Nice. And there's the Zion for you, Cody Passmore, who won that in Cello Pack 23. Centering, edges, corner, surface, obviously, all a 9-5. There you go, already great. And green. For St. Patrick's Day. So thanks for celebrating the holiday with us. One of the weirdest holidays in recent memory due to all the, all the craziness in the world. But thanks for spending your time with us. We appreciate it. And we'll see you next time on jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm Joe. I'm out.